It's the Deep Slant 101 presented by Xfinity. Joining me, second year wide receiver Nico Collins. Nico, must be nice to not hear rookie oh, yeah, anymore, yeah, it's right? Crazy. Yeah, it is kind of crazy. You know, it came fast though, but you know, I'm glad, you know, be got second year under my belt, you know, ready for year two. For sure. All right, so it's OTAs. Lovey Smith said this is really a period for individual improvement. Yeah, so, sure. you know, what, what are your goals here through the next few weeks? Man, I'm just working on things I need to prove on from um, last year. You know, I feel like it's a lot of things to work on my game. Um, I feel like it's a great opportunity for everybody, you know, to come in, you know, great, get time with the quarterbacks, um, work on the things I feel like, you know, that need to be worked on to for improve for the season. You know, so I feel like it's a great time for everybody to come out here and work on the things, you know, everybody need to work on. What is that process like working on the chemistry between you and Davis Mills? I know you guys have worked a little bit this offseason before you even got to OTA. Uh -huh. So tell us a little bit about how you and him plan to get better, work on your timing. Yeah, and stuff. We, all, we all plan to get better, man. You know, um, Davis, he, um, he planned to, you know, throw a position, you know, um, for quarterbacks, receivers and tight ends over this offseason. Um, so it was a great opportunity for the Wild House tight ends go out there and play, um, you know, get the timing down right, you know, get the footwork because, you know, we have ended our season kind of early, you know, didn't, didn't like that feeling, you know, but I feel like it was a great time, you know, to get back on the field, you know, um, get that juice back going, you know, get the timing back right, you know, so we come out here prepared for OTAs. Is it different working with a quarterback like that off season, you know, in a different place, just you guys just working out? It's a little bit more fun, a little bit more relaxed. Yeah, yeah you know, it is, it is kind of fun, you know, different scenery, you know, we in Atlanta, you know, we in his state, you know, his city, <laughs> you know, you know, he's from Georgia. So um, it was great to go down there, you know, for a good week, you know, get a great week of work, you know, um, with everybody, you know, so. I feel like that, that helped out a lot. I feel like wide receivers and quarterbacks, it's not just the chemistry on the field, but you guys have to sort of get in sync off the field, too. Were you able to do that as well? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, we did go to dinner, though. We did. But, you know, <laughs> after we got done with the throwing session, you know, it was kind of one of those, like, all right, I'm going to go lay down because, you know, <laughs> we got back. We all flew back you know, to Houston, you know, Sunday, you know, to work get ready for workouts Monday. So, you know, that was a pretty, you know, it was a grind week. You know, it really wasn't no vacation, you know, but it was a work, you know, work week, you know, but um, our time off, you know, we got to enjoy it. For sure. All right, so you got Pep Hamilton now running the offense. He was here last year, but is you know how what is the adjustment like to a new system for you? Does it you know what are the challenges? Does it feel sort of similar to last year? You know what excites you the most about this offense? This year? Um, you know everything. You know it's a new offense. You know new new coaches. You know I feel like it's a great opportunity for everybody. You know um, as I feel like now OTAs. You know we going out here get the timing down right. You know find the things. You know what works and what doesn't work. You know I feel like it's a great opportunity. You know to find everything out. You know so. We all here working, you know, after everybody's here, you know, we stacking days, you know, we're getting better every day. You know, I feel like that's what's going to count at the end of the day, you know, right. count on Sundays. I was going to say, you got you got a new uh, wide receiver in your group, John Mechie. We saw him out here. Obviously, he's not practicing yet, but, yeah. Yeah. you know, what? when you think back to your rookie your rookie experience and OTAs, you know, what, what are going to be the challenges for him? What does he really need to get better at right now? Man, I say hydrate. That's the first one because <laughs> it, it get hot. Get I'm nice. still sweating even though I'm not even running. But I say um, just you know, the playbook, man, you know, just – at the end of the day, it's football, you know, it's the thing you've been doing your entire life, you know, it's just another level, you know, it's nothing changes, you know, it's just got to up one, you know, you got to up your game a little bit, you got to do a little more, you know, but, you know, we all there for them, got to bring them in, arms open for them, you know, let them know that, all the rookies know that, you know, it's, we all love, it's our brotherhood, you know, we all here for you, you know, whatever you need, just let us know, you know, but we all going to get better for sure. You know, you know, when he get back for camp, man, we're going to work. We're all going to work, for sure. Excited for that. We're excited, excited to, to see you back out here on the field sure. as well, Nico. Thanks Thank so much you. for the time. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching, and go Texans. Like, subscribe, and ring the bell for new content.